Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no, 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 no. It's the... It's the Dementors. Ah, we gotta go. All right, come on, you two. Alright, Survivors Polly Jr. here. Welcome back to Minecraft Exile Island. It's a brand new day. Another day to live through. Better get started. <laughs> and it's glorious. What a lovely sunny day here on our tropical paradise island uh, archipelago is what it really is. What did I just see? Was that a cow or a spider? I think I saw something just disappear. Went poof real, real quick. I think it was a spider. Yeah, we need uh, we need string so we can make a fishing pole and do some more, do some fishing. I haven't done any fishing yet, really. And that would be lovely. We need a lot of things. We need a lot of things. However, I think today what we're going to do is go on a, uh, a little adventure. I want to go check out that ruin right there, an ocean ruin. Um, but we do need iron. We do need iron. We need to advance to the Iron Age, and that is something that we must prioritize. Um, one other thing I really want to do, I don't think we're going to get to it today, unfortunately, is build a beach house right here on the beach. And uh, we'll put it right over here on some stilts. We'll have it half on the water, half on the beach. It's going to be glorious. However, I do want to make it out of uh, birch wood, and I just don't have enough birch. Not today yet. So, I think we're going to have to wait for some birch trees to grow. And in the meantime, we're going to uh, go do some fun stuff. So, once again, thank you very much for all the likes and the feedback and the comments. Keep them coming. It is very much appreciated. Now, let's go check out this uh, this ruin over here. I'm super curious to see what's over there. Oh, there's an island behind it. <gasps> wow. Oh, look at the birch wood there. Holy cow. Oh, and this is drowned. <laughs> Hi, buddy. <laughs> Incoming. And there's another one over there. I see the top of his head. All right, as long as they don't have tridents, we should be okay. Do you have a trident? You don't have a trident. Nope. Good. Good. He's gurgling. He is gurgling. Uh, all right, let's see if we can take them out. Um, oh, there's uh, magma cubes. Magma cubes. Magma blocks. We want magma blocks, in fact. I'm thinking maybe we could set up some magma blocks around our island. Hi. Um, and maybe use them as perimeter defense, right? Because if you stand on them, they do damage. They burn you. And that would be fantastic. Uh, and I think they also create bubbles that you can breathe um, underwater. You can replenish your your oxygen. I'm going to park the boat right here. I don't see anybody crazy around here. Tridents can be a real problem. They do a lot of damage um, in normal mode. In hardcore mode, it'll be one or two hits. Well, maybe, maybe two hits. I don't think it would be a one-shot kill. But I think two, maybe three hits with a trident. We are toast. So that is something we gotta watch out for. Oh, somebody getting burned? Oh, yeah. All right, here they come. Here they come. Let's take them out. Actually, we want a trident. It would be great if somebody did spawn with a trident if they were close to us so we could kill them fast and maybe get that trident because that is one of the victory conditions, right? We put that down on the wall in our hidey hole that we want a trident. And we're going to need Nautilus shells too. But these guys don't drop Nautilus shells. I think they have to spawn with them. Hey, get out of my boat! <laughs> Look at this guy! He's on fire in the boat. My boat better not catch fire. All right, you stay right there. We're gonna go get the uh, treasure. Here it is. Open up! There it is! It's a buried treasure map, some coal, and a stone axe. Wow. Not very good. I mean, the treasure map is fantastic, but the rest of the loot is not very good. So yeah, check it out! We got our first treasure map, guys! Now, it doesn't really give us much indication of where it is. It's literally just an X on the map. An X marks the spot. You can see our little location up on the top left-hand corner. And we need to figure out which direction this is. And we'll go sail in that direction and go fetch it. But I think for right now, let's grab that. Um, we're going to grab this too. So these magma blocks are going to be amazing for perimeter defense, guys. It's going to be so awesome. I'm going to surround our entire island in magma blocks. And then uh, when the zombies come after us at night, they'll get sucked down to the blocks. And they'll get uh, they'll take damage. They'll take a little burn damage. So that's only four. It's not many. Maybe there's another one around here somewhere. Oh, sand is going to be glorious. I mean, think of the contrast. When we were underground, we had no sand. But here on the islands, obviously, we're going to have an endless supply of sand and therefore glass. And glass is good because we're going to make an awesome beach house with big, big windows. I can't wait. Yeah, so cool. All right, let's get in the boat. Let's go check out this island real quick. Maybe I should grab uh, some birch. There might be some animals here, too. You know, it would be great. Chickens. 
I mean, I don't like chickens. They're all spies. However, we do need their feathers and their eggs would be spectacular too. So let's pull up and let's go explore this island. I love that we have this treasure map. It's going to be so amazing tracking down treasure. <gasps> Big cave. Ooh. I like holes. They always lead to adventure. <laughs> There's a sheep. Not that the sheep is going to help us at all because... Whoop. What are you eating, buddy? Can I have some? Look at all the grass. <gasps> I hear chicken feet, and I hear a chicken talking. Oh my gosh, dude. I should have brought my lead. We could have brought this guy home. Dang it, we got two leads from Waldo. All right, I'm going to grab a whole bunch of the birch here because we're going to need the birch for our tree, our beach house. Oh, I hear a zambi. And today I really want to focus on finding iron, and I'm thinking that we're going to go down in that cave. And see if we can get some iron. Once we get iron, things are really going to start to roll. We can make shears. We can make a shield. Oh, you spying. He's probably going to tell the Dementors where we are. They're going to come out tonight, most likely. There was one Dementor last night. Dementors, by the way, are just um, the the uh, the phantoms. The phantom menaces. <laughs> but you better step away. I can't. This chicken can't die. I don't want to kill it. Not yet, anyway. We need to make more chickens. It's the only chicken in the area. And we need that dude's feathers to make arrows. Holy moly. I love this seed. I love this seed so much. Again, the seed for this map, if you're interested, is down in the description below. It's I hate Corona. All lowercase, one word. Oh, look at all the little sapping, sappings, sappings. Grab them all, put them in the ground. We need all the birch we can get to make our beach house. It's going to be glorious. I can't wait. We'll probably do that in the next episode. But yeah, this uh, this whole this map is just full of islands so far. It's like a really really cool archipelago. Now I'm gonna grab some. I'll grab a little bit of oak too while we're here, and then we're gonna go jump in a hole, and we gotta get some iron. Gotta be some iron in there, hopefully, and then we can get started with uh, shears. We can make our pumpkins, our jack o' lanterns. That is our uh, Wilsons, and we can use those for lighting. And of course, we can make. Uh, better tools and weapons and all that fun stuff. All right, let's go check out this hole. I love that dynamic lighting. It's so crazy cool. Hi, bo hi pal. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Here they come. All the zombies coming up. See what's up. Yeah, come on outside in the beautiful sun. I don't think they like a tropical paradise quite as much as I do. Oh, so hot. It is hot today. Super, super hot. Fact, what time of day is it? Oh my gosh, sun's going down. We gotta get in here quick. Come on, come on, come on. Please be some iron. Please be some coal. Oh, that's it. Nah, that's a creeper and a skeleton. That's not what I want. <laughs> well, the creeper didn't go after the skeleton, huh? Oh, jeez. Arrows flying. All right, you might have to vacate. We might have to vacate. Oh gosh. Looks like we're not gonna get in the hole after all. <laughs> Dang it. I'm gonna put that down because I don't want to place it by accident. Oh, I see you, creeper. He's trying to creep. I didn't get to the hole. All right, here's what we can do. Let's let's head back because it's going to get dark. And all the bad things are going to come out. And I don't want to get stuck here with all the bad things. So let's grab the boat and let's boogie. I really do want to go down there. All right, we got to get out of here. Let's go. Let's go in the boat and drive. All right, that's a scary island. That's like Monster Island. That's what we're gonna call that, Monster Island. Let's get back home and we'll get, um, we'll go back there tomorrow in the morning in the sunshine. Those Dementors are gonna be out tonight too. I think it's been four nights so far since we slept. That means we're gonna get a couple of those, uh, of the Phantoms tonight. So we wanna get indoors where it's safe. And I wanna set up these, um, I want to set up these magma blocks over here. By the way, I put um, those are pumpkin seeds because we had a couple of pumpkin seeds from the pumpkins that we found in the island. I'm going to put the treasure away. Awesome. And now let's go put these magma blocks over here. Like right in front of the door? I think that would be pretty awesome. Let's, uh, let's see. I want to knock them into the water. So let's dig down here. So if they come up to the front door, right, we can just knock them back into the water right here. 
And we'll get a lot more of these. There's probably a ton of them around here. All the um, all the, the ruins will have them. And there might even be like an underwater ravine where you can find dozens of them. Ooh, give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Yeah. That'll help. Ooh. Okay, I don't want to step on it because it hurts. All right. That's cool. I'm going to back in now, close the door, and get organized. Look at all that birch. 48 birch wood. That should be enough for a uh, for a house. And go figure, right? The first coal that we found was in a treasure chest. <laughs> um, I want to do something with this. I want to turn that into the Mob Gorilla 9000, or at least a version of it. Yeah, it's not going to be quite as nice because, again, we're not going to be spending a lot of time in here. But we can do this at the very least just to block anything from falling down in there and getting out. That's all we have to do. Open that up and then just wait. Oh, I hear a drown. <gasps> I hear a drown. Someone's coming. Okay. Let's go welcome. Let's go welcome our neighbor. Hi, neighbor. <laughs> Hello? Who's out there? Oh, 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 here we go. We got a volunteer. Hi, buddy. Come on right over here. It's coming from a bad angle. That's the only problem. I really want to get these all the way around the island. Maybe two or three wide. That'd be great. Now step on the block, you ding dong. Come on. Come on over here and get me. He's not going to. See, if we go inside, we can knock him into it, though. Maybe we'll try that. I'm going to run past him. Goodbye. Then we'll just knock him into the uh, into the blocks. I think I'm going to replace the door with a gate. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going? Come on over here. <laughs> okay, there we go. Knock him in. That's what I'm looking for. Right there. A little extra damage, not much. But like I said, once we get more of those blocks, we can surround the whole island and maybe just have a big platform of them right here. <laughs> maybe even dig this dirt up. Put some there. It's going to be pretty amazing. Oh, somebody left their balls behind. Yeah, I'll fetch those later. Not that we need them. Can't do anything with them right now. Well, we got some time to kill before the sun comes up. So let's make a let's make a pen for our animals. We don't want them wandering around free range like because they might disappear or get killed or something like that. Oh, there's a spider there. We got to get the spider. We need string. All right, let's go get that guy. But first. I want to make up some, uh, let's make up some fencing and maybe we'll make a pen over there where the, where the cows live. That seems like a pretty decent spot. So we just need a whole bunch of fences and then a fence gate. And hopefully those Dementors don't come out tonight because if they do, we're going to get harassed the whole time we try to do this. <laughs> it could be a bit dangerous, but we got to get that string. Hopefully that spider is still there. Let's go. I don't see any Dementors right now. So I think the coast is clear, or the sky is clear, I should say. I see two spiders. Oh, yeah, look at those beautiful eyes. I love your beautiful red eyes. I don't like the skeleton, though. There he comes. Can we take him on the boat? Just don't knock me out of my boat, all right? Yeah, we got him. Yep, yep, is that a major disadvantage in that water, aren't you? Aren't you? I like water. There we go. That's the string we need. I'm going to go get this guy, too. The more string, the better. Yeah, you're not a water spider, are you? Too bad for you, pal. Look at me, look at me, Bob and Weave. Oh, he got me. Dang you. All right, we just grab that string, grab this string. Get, whoa, creeper. <laughs> okay, I'm not too worried about the creeper in the boat. <laughs> but I only got one of the strings. Dang it. Oh, I see it. It's way down there. Uh, should we go for it? I'm gonna go for it. I can swim fast. Watch, watch me swim. You wanna see me swim? Plus, there's a spider. What the heck? There's a pig here. Where'd the pig come from? <laughs> We have a pig castaway. <laughs> Piggy Wiggy the castaway. That's amazing. All right, I'm just going to head back. The one string is enough to make the um, to make the fishing pole. I don't want to get greedy. Not with that creeper over there. Don't want to get greedy. You know what they say about greed? It killed the cat. So we don't want to do that. There we go. I got our two string. We can make a fishing pole. Our first one on the uh, Exile Islands. Fantastic. Oh, you know what we could do? <gasps> you know what we could do? We could even fish the mobs into the uh, into the magma blocks. That's going to be glorious. Oh, I can't wait. Except there's nobody around to do it to right now. Um, all right, let's close up. Let's have some kelp. Okay, let's go do this. It's a bright, sunny, brand new day. And I think we're going to go back to that island where the cows are. Whip up this quick uh quick 
corral. And then we'll go fetch the animals and bring them over here. They can all hang out together. And that is so weird. There's a piggy over here. Oh, here's the string. It finally floated. It came up. Got it. Got it. And it's much safer now without the creepers around. Hi, Piggy Wiggy. Where'd you come from? <laughs> Where's your crash? Did you crash on a ship? Is it still good? Can it float? Can we get out of here? No. Actually, we don't want to get out of here. We like it here. So we're not going anywhere. Um, all right. Let's see. Do we have any nice flat area? How about right here up on top? I'm going to take this tree down make a little space and we're gonna make it small pen it's not gonna be very big but it's gonna hold our animals and keep them safe and in one place we do not have any free range organic animals around here all right more birch wood is always good oh look who's over there it's a zambi hi zambi i don't think he's gonna make it i don't think you're gonna make it pal hate to break the news to you <laughs> he's gonna try anyway he might he just might all right let's do one two three whoops one, two, three, four, five, and six. Should have enough of this. One, two, three, four. Doesn't have to be perfect, but it has to work. Oh, he's sizzling all right. Nobody, nobody, nobody. Sorry. Oh, you were so close. You almost made it. A for effort. A for effort, buddy. A little hot out today. Where's your sunscreen? Oh, well. Um, you know what I want to do, though? I want to make two... I want to put two um, gates over here. Yo, it's too bad that we lost the llamas, by the way. I just forgot to tame them. If you tame them, the um, the traders' llamas, I'm pretty sure they'll stick around. But sadly, I did. I forgot to tame them, and they escaped. All right, come on in here, guys. I love that we have the leads, though. <laughs> so it wasn't a total loss. There we go. Get inside. Give me the leads. And then we got one more over here. Now, hopefully we get another piggy that crashes over here on the islands. Look at this guy trying to get away. I told you, you're not a free-range cow. You're a captive cow, so get over here. Come on now, stop fraternizing with the turtles. Stick with your own kind. What's that? You were born free? Well, sorry, not anymore. Yeah, they were born free, and they had the whole place to themselves to wander and roam and frolic, and now they're in a pen um, now that I showed up. <laughs> <laughs> it's for your own good. It'll keep you safe. Get a shelter in place. We don't want you going out and getting uh, getting in trouble. All right, let's go. Let's go back to that other island because we do need iron. We need it so badly. We can't make any lights without iron. Got to make our jack o' lanterns, but we need shears to carve up them pumpkins. And of course, iron is going to give us many other things that we're going to need. Most notably, a shield. I feel naked without my shield. Can't block a darn thing without a shield. All right, this in the offhand again is a little tricky. Just don't want to right click anything by accident. We could just place it down in the middle of the place. Oh, there's iron. <gasps> Ooh. And you know what, Let's put it down. Ow, I told you, ow. Okay, they're fighting each other. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. That's what we like to see. Oh, we get to watch it too in the, in the light, campfire light. <laughs> I should have made a couple more campfires. All right, let's heal it up. There's one more skelly still in there, but we can take him out. Those arrows do a lot of damage on hard mode. I've got no way to block. Can't block without a shield anymore. There's some arrows and some bones. Oh, sweet. I'm going to grab that iron right there quick. Ow. Oh, 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 run. I want to bring him out here. If we can fight him in the sun, we'll have an advantage. Here he comes. All right, let's have uh, some more kelp. It takes three kelp to fill up one little meat pop. Chicken, be quiet. Chicken's trying to give us away. He's trying to give away our location. All right, he's not coming out. He's smarter than the... Uh, oh, there he is. Hi, buddy. <laughs> smarter than the zombies. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, me. Ow. Oh, he got me. It's pretty good shooting. Pretty good shooting, but he's not, he's not stupid enough to come out here and burn himself to a crisp. We're just going to have to jump him. Let's get up to full health, and we're going to jump him. Oh, wait a minute. We can smother him. Look at the sand. Go. Oh, dang it. <laughs> oh, he's burning now. Yeah. I thought you were smart. Not so smart after all, are you? Yeah, I think the sand piece that I dug was the one that was right above his head. Okay. All right. So who's the smart one now? Yeah, let's grab some sand. We're going to need some. Oh, dang it. Man, can we just get down there and get what we came for? I'm not too worried about the zombies, though. Oh, 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 lucky strike. 
Lucky strike. Alright, grab that iron, please. It's right there. I still haven't got it yet. <laughs> got it! Yay! New recipes unlocked. Okay, I see motion over there, but it's just a bat. Let's get out of here quick. Man, this is so scary. I don't want any creepers getting us. Look at all the coal there. All this iron. Fantastic. We're going to be able to make our shears. We'll make a shield. And that will be life-saving indeed. Um, you know what else I need? I actually need diorite. <laughs> I have an idea for the diorite as part of our beach house build. But I really shouldn't grab it right now. I'll grab some of the coal. Okay. I think we're going to go now. Let's get out. Oh, sun's going down. Okay, this is bad. This is bad, especially if those Dementors come out. we got to get these animals out of here. I especially want the chicken. I guess I could have used the seed, right, to draw them out. To trick them to get into my boat, but I wasn't thinking. We've got the lead. That'll work. Um, should we go for the sheep, too? Let's see if we can save a sheep. <laughs> We can't stay here long, though, because the, the bad things are going to start coming out. Uh oh Uh-oh. Oh, no, 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 no. It's the... It's the Dementors. Ah, we got to go. All right, come on, you two. Don't give me any lip. Don't give me any trouble. We got to get out of here. Immediately. Okay, where's my boat? Come on. Can't you guys walk any faster? One of them can get in the boat. And the other one I'm going to have to pull. Somebody get in the boat. Who wants to get in the boat with me? <laughs> Ooh, somebody in. I don't think I can get him in the boat with me in the boat. I don't know that they're being stubborn. Fine, I'll just pull you. All right, stay close now. This is this is trolling. <laughs> this is fantastic. <laughs> we got a chicken and a sheep. We're going to bring them right home and put them in the pen. And hopefully the Dementors don't catch up with us. I heard them, but I don't see them anymore. Okay, we can go full speed with these leads. They're pretty strong. Yeah, that Waldo, he really knows how to make a lead. <laughs> All right, here we are. Home sweet home. I don't want that chicken to get anywhere near that fire. Uh-oh, what was that? Did you just lay an egg? I think I think the chicken just laid an egg. It was either that or it was a trident. I couldn't tell. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to... I don't think I can get him to the pen right now. It seems like kind of a dangerous proposition. So I'm going to push the chicken. I guess I can get them both in the boat, right? Will they stay in the boats? One boat, and then get this guy in the boat. Come on, get in the boat. I don't want you to cook yourself. I mean, I love mutton and everything, but I want you to stay alive. There we go. They're alive. Now, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get inside. <laughs> Ooh, spider. Spider, spider, spider. We could use that guy's string. I'm gonna go in first and get the iron going. Now that we have it, I'm gonna cook it up. Eight iron. And there we go. Away it goes, our first iron. Fantastic. We got some bones, too. We got some arrows. Three arrows here. I'm just going to put them away for now. We don't have a bow yet. We only have one string. All right. Let's check on the iron. We got plenty here to get started. We just need two for the shears. Oh, man. Who would have thunk that shears would be so fantabulous? And we're going to carve these up. But that's not how you do it. You got to place them down. And then you carve them up. Snip, snip. Hello, Wilson. And now they're Wilsons. Well, they will be as soon as we give them brains. So we got to give them the brains. Now, these torches are perfectly legit, but we only use them to light up our carved pumpkins. Uh, just like that. There we go. Wilson is back. Hi, buddy. Oh, man, it's so nice to see you. We've been here all over so long. I'm going crazy. I'm losing my mind. Welcome home. All right. Fantastic. So now we have some lighting. <laughs> we have two pumpkins so far. And we got plenty of seeds. We're going to have to grow a ton of pumpkins. We're going to have a massive pumpkin farm. Stop flapping your wings. You can't get away. You're in my boat. He's trying to get away. What a dumb chicken. Okay, let's get the rest of the iron here. Let's make up a shield. That is going to be glorious. There we go. Our shield. Oh, yeah. Game changer. Game changer. Now we can block. Now we can block, and that will save our life and mitigate damage. It's all about mitigating you gotta mitigate that's what they say you gotta mitigate and we have five iron ingots left we could make uh, a helmet or a bucket uh you know i'm gonna hang on to it i'm gonna hang on to it it's important we'll we'll figure out what we want to make um but for now i'm just glad that we have these two things dealt with all right 
let's do one more thing before we have to call it quits for the day because this episode is getting kind of long i'd like to get these two uh two friends here in the corral where they're nice and safe and uh, we don't have to worry about them escaping or getting killed by anything nasty um i do want to get uh well the pumpkins we don't necessarily need but i'm thinking i would like to get maybe a little bit of wheat and we can grow a couple of cows it's too bad we only have one pig it does take two to tango um and the chicken we can always make new chickens once we get some eggs so that won't be a problem you really don't need two chickens to tango apparently <laughs> uh all right we got a couple of wheat let's see is that ready and now it is all right uh that's good enough that's good enough we just need we just need two because there's only two cows anyway so we got the chicken and we got a smelly sheep right behind me and now we're gonna go bring him over and get him in the pen good morning i told you to put your sunscreen on all right let's get the chicken in here then we'll go get the sheep come on you spy chicken get in there don't let anybody out get in there all right got one spy chicken lay eggs and we can make you some friends okay now let's go take care of this spider first Sticking to the trees in here. Oh, look at this. Look at what I have. Go ahead. Try it. It's nice, right? Boom. Haha. <laughs> mitigate. You gotta mitigate. <laughs> Follow me, sheepy. Right on in here. Uh oh, we got a drown coming. Get in here quick. Alright, close the door. And uh oh. I hope I'm getting the right guy. Did I get the right guy? Let me turn around. Yep, got the right guy. Parrots and the bats. <laughs> Little baby. Welcome to captivity, kid. It's for your own good. Quarantine. Zero percent free range is for your own good. Trust me on this, okay? I know. I'm the expert. And now I think we can call it quits. Although I hear a drown coming. Does he have a trident? I don't care now, because now that I have a shield, I can block the tridents. Does not have a trident. I'm not even going to waste my time. Let's get back home, and then um, I'm going to get ready for the next episode. I'm going to collect a whole bunch more of the birch wood and anything else that we need. And we're going to build up a lovely beach house right here. It's going to be glorious. So with that, my friends, we're just going to call it quits. I'm going to sit right here by our campfire with old Wilson. And we're going to catch up and see how he's been. I haven't seen him since the 404 prison. Oh, look. Look, we got another pumpkin up, too. Let me go grab that. <laughs> the more Wilsons, the better. Hi, turtle. You want to come join us? Yeah, come on up here. Come on. Don't make me come get you. Come on, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, there we go. That's a good. Can you put leads on on turtles? Apparently not. All right. Well, I'm gonna go back over here, sit by the campfire with my with my old buddy Wilson, and we'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day. Bye bye.